Republican study group is calling the trillion dollar infrastructure bill a Trojan horse for Democrat social spending and Green New Deal initiatives. Larry Kudlow joins me right now. All right, Larry, big picture question here. Can you live with this infrastructure plan? If it goes through virtually as is, can you live with it economically? Well, look, one thing is, if it goes through as is, I'm not really sure what as is means. Right, I mean, true. It's a work in progress. <laughs> but you know what I mean. It, I mean, this, roughly this a is, trillion bucks with a $550 million billion of new spending. Can you live with it? Um, there's good and there's not good in this. And, you know, I'm kind of leaning against it. I, I want to acknowledge that there's good stuff. I mean... Half of this bill is good infrastructure, best I can determine without knowing all the legislative details. About 30 percent of it, Stu, is way too green for my taste. This should have been taken up in other committees. Uh, there was never any regular committee process to discuss this. In fact, the whole Green New Deal story has never really been explored carefully. So I don't like that. Yes, there's no corporate income tax in this, but the trouble is it's going to all get put back into the budget reconciliation bill. Yep. So you have a lot of pay-fors that aren't going to work. I mean, $50, $60 billion dollars of dynamic scoring for growth, Stu, you're not going to see it because the Democrats are going to try to put, you know, income taxes, capital gains taxes, estate taxes, foreign taxes into the reconciliation bill. So it's going to drown out uh, anything that might happen that was good on the growth side from infrastructure. I mean, my point here is, I mean, I have lots of details if we want to go through it, but my basic point is this. The budget reconciliation bill is really the big thing here. The infrastructure bill, as I said, pluses and minuses. But the reconciliation bill, that's the bill that the left wing of the Democratic Party wants to use to transform America away from free enterprise towards state planning and regulation and Green New Deal and social spending. And so it's that reconciliation bill that must be stopped if we're to continue some kind of good I, economic story. Larry, am I right in saying that Speaker Pelosi says you've got to have the trillion dollar infrastructure bill, the one trillion dollar, and you're going to have to have the three and a half trillion dollar bill as well. You've got to have them both. That's what she's saying, I believe. Yeah, she is. I mean, she's clearly linked it. She's actually threatened not to take up infrastructure unless and until the Senate sends her a budget reconciliation bill. And, you know, that's too bad, but that's the game plan. And so I don't buy this stuff that the Republicans were had. I mean, I think the GOP senators did the best they could, okay? And I think, as I said, look, there's some pluses in here. Uh, I really, you know, there is infrastructure, and the public wants yeah. some infrastructure. And in the long run, if you just had the infrastructure, bridges, roads, tunnels, water, et cetera, et cetera, um, it would improve the economy okay. a yeah. little bit. It would improve okay. productivity. It's the rest a of the stuff you've got to watch out for. But on the other for. hand, it's, it's the yeah, rest I mean, of look, the stuff you've got to watch out for. The green stuff is. Yeah, I mean, there's environmental social justice marks in here. I don't know what that means, except lots of yeah. subsidies for Green New Deal stuff. I wish, you know, I could be had, Stu, if they would just come out and buy me a nice new Tesla. I would be much more inclined to support the infrastructure bill if they would just buy me a Tesla and all my friends buy them Teslas because to some extent the subsidies in here are exactly. doing just that. They're building recharging stations and, Tesla and they're Subsidizing cars. All right, Larry, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm <laughs> and, dying and to see you in a Tesla, they, they wanna... but I don't expect to see it anytime soon. But I will be watching Stop you. Stop the reconciliation bill. That's okay. the key point. That's the bottom line, actually. Thank you, Steve. Cudlow, weekdays, Absolutely. 4 o'clock this afternoon, Fox 